Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. You can see here I have started coloring my cover art for my cover page for September. Um, I can't really draw that well. I used to be an art major a long time ago, but my drawing skills are not they are not on par. I haven't practiced them in a while. I'd love to get back into it if I ever get the time to. But something I really do love to do, which is also a nice creative outlet for me, is to color. And I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm not a professional. Um, I loved, I used to love uh, mixing colors with crayons and then I moved to colored pencils and the markers has been something that I've been experimenting with. So you can see I'm using pinks and blues to help with the shadows and the highlights. Um, but yeah, I find this very cathartic and so you'll see me speed through this for the next few minutes and I'll leave you to the music while I do that. So I really liked how my bear turned out and surprisingly the blues and the pinks worked really well and I'm going to mimic those in the washi tape that I'm going to use for this. And you might see the uh, little strands of my um, band-aid there. I stabbed myself while I was cooking which is you know not the smartest thing to do but it's what happens when you brush. You should sew down when you're using sharp instruments. Uh, lesson learned. No, None of my blood got in the food. It was fine. Um, but here I'm just using a card to rip my washi. You can tell I'm having a little bit of trouble with it. This is not the kind of washi that's really easy to tear and I didn't think of that, nor do I have an X-Acto knife tool for something like that. So I struggled with it and that's all right. That's part of the process sometimes. Um, we also notice on the right that my September calendar looks a little different than last month. I'm still playing around with this. It's really the only thing that's been changing. I haven't found anything that I feel like works for me yet, but I like how big it is. I like that I can actually write in the boxes and I have the notes section up top to fill in with whatever I might need to note. And then I don't usually take a whole lot of notes in my bullet journal in general. I use sticky notes a lot and they litter my the bottom of my computer in the inside of my notebook until I can figure out where they're supposed to permanently go. Um, unless we're talking about story notes and I just have 
boxes of those. It's, it's ridiculous. Um, my process is pretty much the same, and I'll let you know when we get to, or I'll talk to you a little bit more when we get to the next spread. So here I have my master test list again. Um, it's pretty much the same thing that I did last month and I've been doing for a while now. It's been working really, really well for me. It makes me productive. I can figure out where all of my stuff goes on my weeklies when I do it this way. I get my overall tasks, my business schedule, my author schedule, and my school schedule. The fall semester just started and I teach English at the university locally. so. I'm going to have a few more things to juggle, and since it's the first week, I've been taking a lot of naps because it just it's hard to get back into the rhythm of things and teaching uh, four classes in a row after having not talked to people alive for months. So, I'm getting back in the gear there, making them laugh at me. Apparently, I'm hilarious. I did not know this. Uh, would have been useful as a kid to know that I was funny instead of that weirdo over there, but... Life is what it is, and you grow into yourself. Um, but as you can see, I'm just filling out my normal Patreon, my blogs. Again, I have Transcendent coming up uh, this semester, so I have to keep on track of that stuff. I don't actually fill out my master task list, because when I was filming this, it was still pretty early in the month, and I don't know what I'm going to have to do next month yet. But uh, the newest addition is, you'll see, when I get to my school section, that I have... Um, color coding the time that I'm going to have to devote to grading because I spend probably a half an hour to an hour on each student's paper because I like to be thorough and I want to make sure that uh, I don't miss a comment that might spark that thing for them that makes them learn a rule that otherwise they wouldn't have if I didn't leave that comment. So I comment on everything. It's pretty brutal. I say that I murder papers, but yeah. Hopefully they appreciate that in the long run. We'll see. I've had a few tell me they do, but, you know, it's a, it's a required class, and I don't expect everybody to be in love with it. It's all right. So now I'm putting some washi up, and, yeah, that'll be about finishing my spread, and we'll move on to the editorial calendar. Again, same thing I've been doing. This thing is pretty full right now, and will be until January. Although hopefully it'll keep going because we have another anthology coming out in the winter, which is in the air. And we, I've finished reading. Anthony's not quite there yet, but we hope to send out uh, acceptance and rejection letters this next month, so in September, and have that come out. January, February, I'm hoping. We'll see what happens. Sometimes plans don't always uh, manifest in the way we expect, and that's okay too. But now, I'm just going to fill all this in, let you enjoy the music, and get my button gear to do some other things today.
did that since the super thick washi wasn't fitting but I still wanted some on this page I decided to take my um, paper cutting tool and split it in half make two thinner strips which I still struggle with as you can tell trying to rip these things in the spread but I like the way that it connected all of these spreads together and I'm gonna put a little pink up there as well but you know since we're talking instead of leaving you to the music for the last minute or so of this I wanted to talk a little bit about something that I did today um, I mentioned in one of my previous videos that I am not a runner and my husband has been getting me to run and I've been trying to work out more consistently and so I've been pretty good about working out about four or five times a week in the last month but this week school started and so my schedule is out of whack and I didn't work out for three days and I got on the treadmill today and the first time I'd been able to run two miles straight without stopping at an increased speed and I'm just so ecstatic with my progress. But I just wanted to mention that sticking with something is really rewarding because the time before that I struggled. It was a mental workout more than a physical one. But in any case, there's my week, my monthly plan. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.